Welcome back to Let's Read Judge Dredd. Today's episode is Crazy Barry Little Mo, part one. So let's get into it. His name is Mo, and he lives inside Barry's head. Mo tells Barry to do things. Wrong things. At least Barry used to think they were wrong. But at first, Barry refused to listen, but slowly, gradually, Mo won him around. Nowadays... Barry usually goes along with him. In fact, Barry's begun to think Moe's wrong things are actually okay, a okay things. This is unfortunate. Oh, yeah, all right. Uh, because Barry is a judge. Moe hates lawbreakers. He figures the judges are a little too soft. So, sometimes, he might tell Barry to use a little more force than necessary. Or suggest, just suggest, that maybe some creeps or other might perhaps feel the benefit of a broken arm. See the others? Yeah, Dred. Yeah, Dred. Baldy went down the underpark spit gun up the uh, escape to the second floor apartment. I'll take spit gun. Mo's smart, too. He never lets uh, Barry go over the top when there are witnesses around. Some judges are old fashioned and they wouldn't understand Barry's little excess. You're looking at 20 years already. Uh, Eunice, drop that gun or we start talking recyc. But I am. Not from where I'm standing, Dread. Have it your way, creep. <laughs> In the underpark. <laughs> Upstairs, don't make use of what don't make walls like they used to. <laughs> Control, we've got some damage. We've got some damage repair apartment on uh, <clears throat> Tonto. Notify welfare. Old couple look like they could use some psychiatric counseling. We got one for recycle, possibly two. We'll let you know. Sometimes Barry comes up with things himself. Vroom. Crunk. He came up with a good one just this morning. Uh, you got me, man. I give up. You hear that, Mo? He gives up. Little bag of scum guns down four innocent people, squirts acid in the kid's face. He just gives up. He wants me to take him to his nice warm cube. Now that's not right, is it, Mo? That's not justice. Well, what, what do you mean? Who are you talking to? Daddy is in a cube won't give that kid his face back. Daddy is won't buy it for lives. Justice. I could give him justice. Go on, Barry. Do it. He's got it coming. Give it to him. Vroom, scurry. What are you? Oh, jeez. Carton. Here. Nice bit of damage. Creep didn't give me any choice. Scum like that, I'm at it coming anyway. Sometimes when Barry's alone, Mo comes out and perches on his shoulder. Then they can talk. This is nice sitting here. Yeah, nice. You know, when I crushed that scumbag, it felt really good. That's cause the way. That's cause that. Da 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 da. That's the way it should be, Barry. 
drives the blame, you know. Huh? That special psychiatric assignment they sprang on you? That special psychiatric assessment they sprang on you? He was suspicious down in the end of the park. You could see it. He must have reported you. Yeah, I guess. What are we going to do about it? What are you going to tell them about? What are you going to tell them about us? Nothing, boy. You want me to be uh, rammed in a psycho cube? Wouldn't that be better? Maybe you need treatment. I mean, I'm obviously a manifestation of madness. Who, you? You're a little blue guy who lives in my head. Sometimes you tell me to give it to creeps, and uh, if I reckon the creeps deserve it, then I give it to them. What could be more natural than that? Eh, you're off your head, Barry. Yeah. The question that worries me, have you at any time committed or com contemplated committing any action which you knew to be unlawful? Lie detector will pick that up. What if uh, they find you, Mo? What if they try to split us up? Ah, don't worry. Just leave it to me. You? <laughs> sure, I'm a, just a figment of your imagination. I can't have done anything, can I? Just switch off and let me do the talking, and we'll get through it, uh, we'll get through it you see? Hey, smart thinking, Mo. Uh... It's the least I can do. We're in this together. You and me, Barry. All the way. Next program, Deep Shrink. Okay. Well, uh, join us again next time to see what uh, good old Mo gets up to. Until then, thanks for watching.